Do you solemnly swear before God and your peers to defend and protect the Welsh Republic and to expel the English invaders, restoring the land of your fathers to its former glory? Uh, yes, I do. Then the Free Wales Army receives you as a brother. Let the brother receive the light. What? Take his blindfold off. Oh, right. There we are. Turn the music off now. Keep hold of that tape. Got to give it back to the library. Oh, uh, am I in then? Yeah. Congratulations, Kai. Oh, Brill. I'll ring my mam and tell her. No, you're not allowed to tell him, ma'am. Oh, I've been telling her for weeks about this. You stupid twat. This is a secret organisation. What if she tells the police? Oh, she, she wouldn't. She can't leave the house. She's bedbound. Well, don't tell her anymore. But she wants to be involved. It makes her day. She can't be involved. But she already made the biscuits for today's initiation. Oh, well, uh, tell her that St- Stephen Jones says thank you, but it's really important that she doesn't tell anyone else. You boys done in here? The Grave Rubbing Society wants to get in. Oi, no, we got this room till our past. Look, trifle, where's that bit of paper? Oh, right, it must be early. Don't worry, I'll tell them the Three Wheels Army are having a secret meeting. No, don't tell them that. Why not? Because you, you compromise our position, and we might have to mark you out as a collaborator. Yeah, and I won't let you use my pub anymore, and you'll have to go back to having your meetings at the bus shelter. All right, all right. I'm sorry, OK? Could you just shut the curtains, please? Mm, that's more like it. Good half an hour. Right, first order of business. Introducing Kai to the troops. I'm Captain Stephen Jones, but you know me anyway, because I'm the driving instructor. This is Trifle, second lieutenant. Why is he called Trifle? Because I used to be fat. Oh. Um, is it just us? Technically, we've got over 60 members, but if you, if you die or move out of the country or something, then you're still on the books, so once you sign up, you're a member for life. Oh, um, but how many active members do we have? Active soldiers, uh, is four. So that's me, you, Trifle, and Sean's an honorary member because she lets us use a room. Fit for service is two. Trifle's got an administrative role because of his legs, and Sean's got her hands full with a pup. But that still leaves me and you, Kai, ready to carry the war to the enemy. Oh, right. Well, uh, what should we do then? I heard you burn down English caravans and blow up the railway line to London. Oh, no, 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 no none of that. Not anymore. Uh, these days, we like to engage in more psychological warfare. Last week, me and Trifle went up to Cardiff, and I let the tyres down on a police car. Whoa, serious? Yeah, I watched him from Costas. Bloody fantastic it was. Mind weak. Yeah, but that's just a skirmish. Time for phase two of the battle. The kid gloves are off. Time to rev it up in fifth gear. What you got planned, Steve? Listen closely. In there now, you lot. These grave rubbers are getting arsy. Well, shut up, Sean. You've interrupted a crucial briefing. Oh, you're not going round dripping down English road signs again, you Steve. You've got a caution for that last time. Right, right. Who's, who's been leaking confidential information? Trifle, was it you? I, 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 I don't know. What have I told you about unsanctioned communiques? Uh, sorry, Steve. I think I, I think I added it as my Facebook status last week. Oh, for fuck's sake.